Hi, I'm Stevie. This is Straight Out Cinema Review. Straight Out the Cinema from King of Other Planet of the Apes. It's got a runtime of 2 hours and 25 minutes. There's no mid credits or end credits, so you can go straight after you've watched it. Directed by Westfall. I'm going to give this, this is like three and a half, four star movie. It's, it's not as good as War for the Planet of the Apes, and it actually feels like more on the lines of the original Apes series than the new ones. You know, this is set in a to uh, a few, oh, quite a while, a few generations after War for the Planet of the Apes. Like I said, War for the Planet of the Apes is, for me, still the perfect Planet of the Apes movie. But this is an enjoyable, and it really, it's got a really pretty slow pace, great storyline, but it really amps up in the third act. It's kind of worth seeing for the third act, and it's, it really is a sequel baiting movie. I mean, I hope they do a sequel. This is, it looks like it's the start of a new trilogy, and... You know, uh, if they can make them as good as this one and keep amp amping them up because with the uh, last Apes trilogy, it just got better. Going into it, if you watch War for the Planet of the Apes, it will set up the whole story for us if you haven't seen any of the other ones. Just watch War. It sets up uh, a bit about the background about Caesar. That's all you really need to know going into this one. And check it out. Go see it on the big screen. See it in the cinema. It is definitely a cinema movie. Glad I saw it on the big screen. So, yes, I'm going to give this three and a half to four stars. As TV, straight out of the cinema, Kingdom of the Planet of the Apes.